Hi, good morning everybody. This is Brittany at Big Cat Rescue here in Tampa, Florida. We are moving Jinx Leopard home from Punkation, but Mr. Manny is out for a front row view. So I figured we'd start with him while Jamie, Victor, and Afton put together the tunnel that Jinx walks home through. Hi, Anthem. This is Manny Jaguar. Please take a second and share this. Tag your friends and family. <gasps> right, Mr. Man? Jinx had an extended vacation. He went out there a couple weeks before our wildcat walkabout the first week in November. And his enclosure is all done now. We got in every single bubble, which is no small feat. He has a very massive enclosure and we cleaned off the entire roof and we <laughs> did all the raking and we trimmed back a ton of foliage on the back side of his enclosure, making it easier and safer for the keepers to walk around. So huge shout out to everybody who helped on that project because it was a doozy. And so we're gonna go ahead and move Jinx home. And for probably the rest of the day, it will just be a big project going on over there because we have to work on this enclosure. So we'll be clearing the roof, we'll be raking inside and outside in the back sections. I'm not sure if they'll be mowing and weed eating, but that's also potentially going to happen. So you can see everybody's putting together the tunnel that he'll walk home through. You guys have seen that a million times, so I figure we will the tunnel all secured, open the doors for him, and I believe Aaron is the one babysitting the red pole and probably also has his food bucket. So he's in the very, very back of our 22,000 square foot funcation enclosure. We'll also have to move all of his signage back to his home enclosure. We moved Duchess and Jinx's uh, cage signage for the walkabout and now that that is a piece of history <laughs> um, we're going to have to move all of that back and then the next cat that will be up will be Frankie Bobcat it'll be the very first time that he will ever use the tunnel system so along this back wall all the way down to Frankie's enclosure, which he is two cats away from us in that direction there. He'll be able to walk through the tunnel extensions, but none of that is gonna happen until we are able to clear all this debris, clean off the tunnel, get the tunnel all put together, and then he'll walk himself right out here. We'll have to clean up Jinx's old enrichment like he gave it another good smash. He's very patiently waiting. That yellow bucket is breakfast, so he'll be pretty motivated. Oh, he did. Did you get the mint off your pillow? You guys saw giving Tuesday enrichment. He had the cutest little bed. His thank you note is still there, but I don't see the mint. <laughs> it was a fake mint, not a real mint, but it was pretty cute. Did you get the mint off your pillow? It's the best part of going to the Hi. Hi. I like when they leave chocolates. Yeah, animals can't have chocolate though. Hi, buddy. Oh, very nice, thank you. So this is Jinx, our black leopard, and he will swap with Frankie when the enclosure is all cleaned up and ready to go. I know, they only had a couple snaps left. That's why I came back here. People wanted to see you, not just people putting together a, a tunnel. I'm shocked. <laughs> I know, we're almost ready. Yeah. We're almost ready. You can lay back down for another minute. Save that energy. You gotta go all the way up there. I know. Then, and... like all the way up there. <laughs> Right, sweet boy. Don't worry, Jinx does still have cameras at home. Hopefully he'll go back to enjoying his platform that has a camera directly on it. Put hay in 
nice and cozy. A little fun. Where the camera is. Good deal. Oh my goodness, that was very, very close to hitting me in the face. There's just acorn bombs falling out of the trees. Good job, buddy. So I don't know if Frankie will move today. That is going to depend on how quickly the project <laughs> over here would go. And it's a massive roof. So I don't know that that'll happen today, but again, you guys can watch on the cameras. Luckily, first time ever, Frankie won't have to go into a transport. He will get to walk here. Woo, oh, take it slow. It's getting slow. You're only about an hour in on your gab, so it's gonna make you a little Don't waste it all. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Lay down, bub. And you gotta walk oh. all the way over there. Yeah. So long. You have the longest walk ever. It's and like longer he, than vacation. And he never. Oh, oh he's so sweet. Oh my See, perfect flop. Perfect Ooh. flop. Yeah, and he never just cuts through the middle. He walks the entire perimeter with us, usually. You can go home. It is so cleaned up, you won't even recognize it. You won't even recognize it, Bubs. Oh, I thought they were a couple snaps away. I don't know what happened. Very sweet. That is Very so sweet. sweet. That is so sweet, sweet boy. That is so sweet. No, we don't touch the camera. This camera for me. Well, that camera is not for me. I wanted a camera. I'm not just taking it from him. He's Get like, you a I'll strap, carry it. GoPro to strap on you. Oh, if only that was safe to do. That would be really fun. <laughs> That'd be very fun. You're such a good boy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it again. It's a very good view. Oh, you just, all you have to do is lay there and be handsome. I know. Yep, you're pure magic. You are pure magic. Yes, you are. I don't know what's taking so long. You should yell at me. Keep in mind, Jinx is our oldest cat on property. He's estimated to be about 23 years old, so his mobility has started to change. He is on a pain regimen for any kind of arthritis because he was sadly, very sadly, declawed before ever arriving here. Good job, bud. I know, you follow the yellow bucket. This way, Bob. Oh, Aaron, you might have to come this way. I think he's, no, he's, he's going to follow you with the bucket, so you'll have to go this way. I was like, he's going right back into the little section. We got to take the long way. I thought you could just pop out on the other side. I thought he'd follow me, but he saw the bucket and was like, nope. Following the bucket. <laughs> Good job, sir. Good job. <laughs> Good job. You're doing so good. Here's where you could cut through and go straight, but <laughs> we never do that. Good job, my sir. All the way around. Still following the bucket. All the way, not into a lockout though. This way. Good job, buddy. Keep going. Jinx, Jinx. No, let's not hide and seek in the den. There we go. Let's not play hide and seek. Come on, good boy. We're just going home. We're just going home, Bub Bubs. Good job. 
Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Go find the bucket. What a good boy. Over this way. All right, so he just has to come through two doors. He'll walk across the street. Good job, sir. Good job. You're almost to, you're almost here. Come on, I'm almost here. Come here. This way. That a boy. I know that part's weird. Go really slow. Really slow. Very, very slow. There you go. Now we're over the icky part. This way. Turn the corner. This way. This way. Thanks. Jinx. Jinxy. This way. It's open. Good job. You can go get breakfast. Yeah. Go follow Aaron. Oh, <laughs> right into the den. My hay is in here. Don't you want your breakfast? <laughs> yeah, you do want your breakfast. Oh, he will love that. He's going to be a... He went straight in. Yeah, yeah. All right. Our perfect magical guy is now home. Where's this one? Hi, Sneaky. So back to Mr. Manny. They'll tear the tunnel back down and then... What are you doing, slow-mo? So Jinx will enjoy breakfast and we will be tearing down this tunnel and the next cat up, actually, why don't we go see him? It's still Frankie, right? Yeah. Frank, that's plan. Okay. Are you guys mowing and stuff? Okay, cool. So it'll be a full-blown project today and whenever that is done, whether it's today or tomorrow, <laughs> we don't have a lot of people here today. It's my project day though, so I will be jumping in on that. Once I email, or actually I've got to run to the post office because I want to get our eBay auction winners from Giving Tuesday sent out today. We had two winners that added about 500 more dollars to our goal for Giving Tuesday. I don't have the exact number because people are sending checks and people were continuing to donate um, well into yesterday. So. When we do have an official update, we will definitely let you guys know. But I do think <laughs> we definitely met our goal. So thank you so, so much. Jinx is home from Funcation. So keep your eyes on bigcatcams.com if you check out Funcation camera because Mr. Frankie is up next and it'll be the first time he gets to walk there. How exciting! Hi Frankie! How my little boy doing? How's that little boy doing? You can go on vacation. It'll be very fun. No more transport cages for you. Currently Frankie, Shiloh, and Moses and Bailey are all hooked up to the Funcation tunnel. I believe the goal eventually is still to get Filmo and Smalls and their enclosures attached to Funcation so that none of them actually have to go in to the squeeze cage or the transport cage to go to and from. Smalls absolutely hates Funcation though, so honestly don't know if they will connect her. That'll be a lot of effort for a cat that just doesn't like change. Right, Bob? I don't know if Filmo would like it either, but as of right now, cats that we know do okay once they go out there or have never been out there. I will say Moses and Bailey have never gone into Funcation. I do think that they want to attempt that, but with Moses getting older and us having a lot of mobility issues with him where we've been trying to um, get him situated on a medication, we've got one that's doing really well for him now. So I'm not sure when it'll be his next or their turn, but now as far as Duchess and Priya goes, 
Duchess is still going to be in vacation for probably another week or so. Um, we have a lot of painting that we want to get done in Priya's enclosure. I can't not show Filmo when he's looking so adorable right next door. I'm going to see some bonus cats. There's a Filmo! Hi, Philip. Hi! Cute boy! So handsome, so handsome. So we have a work group coming in early December that we're hoping will help us either complete Priya's enclosure if it's not done already, or we'll definitely have something else for them to do, but that's the plan. So as long as it takes us to completely get Priya's home enclosure done, that is how much longer Duchess will be extended on vacation. Right, kiddo? Right, kiddo? You know there's action happening down there. You know there's action happening down there. It's going to be for you. All this project stuff's going to be for you. See if they walked away, film those flopped over. Well, thank you guys for joining. Um, this was a pretty short live today, but there's a lot to get done. So I'm gonna go ahead and shut this down. eBay winners, I'm gonna run to the post office for you guys, and then I will be back to get Funcation all cleaned up for Mr. Frankie to go next. I hope you guys have a great weekend. I can't thank you guys enough for everybody who joined us for all five of our lives on Giving Tuesday and made it such a huge success. We, Afton and I's lives brought in 6,100 and some dollars. That's incredible. And I just oh, love it, love it, love it. It makes me very happy. So if you want to rewatch this or any of the other lives recently, dailybigcat.com. Please make sure you've subscribed over there. I know he's very, very routine active this morning. Food? No food? Food? No food? You've already had breakfast. Actually, he probably hasn't. They've probably gave him a little bit, but have um, held off the rest so that we can help him move because I'm sure he'll want treats all along the way. <laughs> So have a great weekend, everybody. There's Mr. Shiloh on top of his platform. And I am unsure whether there will be a live by me on Sunday or not. I uh, technically took the day off to go to an event, but I'm not sure if I'm doing that or not. So <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't let you know on that. I do think there's going to be a Saturday, Catterday live. I just believe Kristen might not be here but Afton mentioned handing out some more small cat enrichment that we still have left over from Walkabout and now Giving Tuesday. So uh, stay tuned and thank you guys so much. Really, really appreciate all of you. Have a great weekend.